An estimate 40 percent of the food produced in this country is thrown away, a terrible waste considering how many people go hungry, and scientists say it's also bad for the environment. As Paula Evan explains tonight, a local startup is hoping to make a small dent in this big issue by giving you half price on a meal at more than 100 Boston restaurants. A half lamb and beef, half chicken. Sam Newland of Somerville has a full-time job and a couple of side hustles, so he eats out a lot. I haven't bought groceries since April. But he's not going broke thanks to Food for All, an app that offers discount meals uh, from restaurants that have more food than they can sell. You can search by zip code, sandwiches, burgers, meats, vegetarian. There are 200 restaurants on the site. Each offers a certain number of half-priced meals depending on the day's sales. So you're getting the same quality food as anybody else. We don't cook to order, so uh, we have quite a deal bit of waste for the chicken and rice guys figuring out what they'll need on any given day can be a bit of a guessing game and food for all has helped this small chain cut down on what goes into the dumpster by about 40 percent it's clearly a win-win situation for restaurants sabine Vallega and a friend came up with the idea but they discovered it's not just about the bottom line one of the most effective things that you can do to reverse climate change is reducing food waste according to the u.n food waste is responsible for 8% of the world's greenhouse gases. Some is from production, but most landfills are 20% food, which breaks down and creates methane, a gas that scientists say contributes to global warming. Thank you very much. Sam appreciates the environmental benefit, but it's not his primary motivator. So I've saved almost $1,000. The meals are offered at certain pickup times, usually near the end of lunch or dinner hour. Food for All is looking for new restaurants every day, and they've recently expanded to New York City. Paula Eben, WBZ News.